Ladies and Gentlemen, hallo und herzlich willkommen zu einem neuen React hier auf Pete's Meet TV. Heute mit dem Bram, dem Jay, dem Chris und mir, dem Peter. Schön, dass ihr eingeschaltet habt. Und vielleicht erinnert ihr euch noch an das Video, was wir uns mal angesehen haben, wo jemand versucht hat, nur mit Sprachbefehlen einen Berg in GTA 5 hochzufahren. Ne, welches war das? Das war das Video, wo jemand nur mit Sprachbefehlen versucht ah. hat, ja, ja, genau <lacht> das. Und, äh, <lacht> so was <wat> äh <lacht> so Ähnliches Gucken wir uns jetzt nochmal an. Nur diesmal geht es darum, den Berg runterzufahren. Das ist ja einfach. Einfach aufsteigen und dann rollen ja. lassen. Ne? Ja, dann gucken wir jetzt mal, ob das so einfach ist. Hey, this is Doug Doug, where we solve problems that no one has. One of the most fun things in GTA 5 is driving down the top of Mount Chiliad, since it requires this very precise oh, yeah. driving not That's to stupid. just, you know, fall off a cliff and blow up. So I wondered, could you drive down all of Mount Chiliad using only voice commands? Just like before, I used a voice program, which turns my words into game commands. So in this case, we set OSHA to drive the car forward because it's very safe, <laughs> Reggie from Nintendo to turn right, and Leggy from Nintendo to move left. Now the goal <laughs> Here is to drive from the very top of the mountain down into the ocean at the bottom without blowing up. And I don't actually think this will be very hard, so let's turn up the difficulty a bit by adding a five-star police wanted level oh and also God. using a mod which causes hundreds of airplanes to crash all over the mountain. This way, we have to move at a fast pace the entire time, and we can't just take it slow. Yeah. And now, we're all set to begin. OSHA. Now first, we tried this challenge with a bus, which is actually incredibly easy. Since the bus is so large that it can just sort of roll down the mountain without getting too hurt, you do not have to be very precise here. OSHA. Reggie. Reg. Uh. <laughs> uh. <laughs> 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 Wie sieht denn so gut aus? Ja, schön viel wieder aussieht. Alter! Yes, yes! Okay, we just get through these cops. We just get through these cops! We just get through these cops! Almost there, almost there, almost there, almost there! Almost there! Almost there! Alter, was da alles runterknallt! Was ist das? Yo, that, first try is done. It. Next up is a normal car. OSHA. Normal, normal, normal car. car. Really. No, no, excuse me. This is fine. This is nice. This is, this fine. is nice. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Cars are a little bit harder. <laughs> this is going extremely well. <laughs> Reggie. No! Now this did take a bit of experimentation, but a smaller car like this is incredibly sturdy and can just sort of bounce down the hill and then slide sure. smoothly into the ocean. Oh, here we go. Was man mit Mods alles machen kann in GTA 5, wenn auch nur, wenn mal jemand von uns Ahnung darüber hat, davon. It's like a little yeah. turtle. You yeah. can't yeah. just destroy it. Right? Er, uh, Reggie. Legend. Da gibt's auch noch uh, die Mods, schaffen es den Zug zu stoppen. Wo da alles wird gemacht wird, wir können auf Deck den Zug wirklich anhalten. Ah, okay. Red. Oh Gott! Oh Gott! Legend! 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 Go, Rockfire! Go, 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 go! Go! Yeah! Get away! Go, 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 so yes, it is definitely possible to drive down a mountain with voice commands. But now it's time for the real part of this challenge, driving down the mountain on a motorcycle. You get knocked off motorcycles incredibly easily in this game. So we're gonna have to be very precise here. We're gonna have to play like some sort of motorcycle Jedi to dodge the cliffs and pull this off. But I'm warmed up from the bus, I'm ready to play the best GTA 5 of my life. OSHA. Easy, easy stuff, Legy. It's embarrassing how easy this is. Look at this. Easy. Yeah. Oh. Huh. <laughs> Never mind, this is hard as shit. The motorcycle is so light that it will easily pop way up into the air if you hit any small hill or rock. And unlike a vehicle, you die I from top. almost every single jump on a motorcycle. I don't even think a Jedi could do this. I'm liking how this is it's looking good. <laughs> Damn, <laughs> Looking good. Position. Oh. Guys? Well, okay, if we can't survive those cliffs on a motorcycle, then maybe we just need to follow along that hiking trail. That's crazy. Just crazy. Oh, God. This is the ewig viel länger. 
Uh. Ja, immer noch nur drei Befehle, äh, vier Befehle, oder? Ja. Yeah. Less beautiful. This is fine. This ja, is fine. Das ist viel zu tief. Nein. Oh, oh, was? This is fine. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> trail doesn't actually do much. It's still just as dangerous if you go farther down the path. But maybe we just need to take a different path down the mountain altogether. Reggie. 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 So, no, the other paths are actually more dangerous. This initial path is still safest because it has a lot of these sloping hills near the bottom, not just huge drop-offs. But maybe the problem here, it's not the bike or the path. Sure. Maybe this is just a mental performance problem. Master Yoda once said to the Jedi, cowards are those who follow the dark side. Beating a challenge this precise requires losing cowardice and having total mental confidence. Reggie? <laughs> you guys weren't confident enough. We need more confidence. Confidence, 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 <laughs> Shit, confidence, 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 confidence. <laughs> okay, I'm not accelerating anymore. Yo! You really need confidence right now. Go, go, go. Confidence, confidence. <laughs> Fuck! Uh, maybe Master Yoda meant we should literally add a confidence command. Confidence to stop. Yeah, like that. That. Now we're true. Wieder, uh, aufzusetzen. Also, nachdem er gestorben ist, muss er ja wieder da oben sein mit einem ja der hat gerade einen Knopf gedrückt da ist er hoch also einfach ja Reset. dann ist er einfach hochgeflogen quasi ja also und das ist schon dann so ein Schieten quasi ja. naja aber immerhin geht das schnell ja Jedi no confidence my G this is fine this is fine this is fine what shit dude <laughs> they were in great shape things are good yeah. <laughs> you have enough confidence <laughs> <laughs> this challenge is insanely hard. If you go fast down the mountain at all, you'll just fly into the air and then almost always die from gravity. But if you take it extremely slow, all of those planes I added will just kill you. So we need a way to keep moving fast, but not automatically die from any jump. And I think it's time we remember Master Yoda's advice. If no mistake have you made, yet losing you are, a different game you should play. We have to <laughs> tweak the rules of the game itself to make this challenge work. So after some debate, we decided to add a jump command to the motorcycle. This allows us to jump the bike upwards, kind of like using the force. And we can use this mid-air to slow our downward momentum, and it means we can actually survive some of those huge jumps in the air. And now all we need is a name for this new jump command. Okay, what do we need a word for jump? Gibt's aber normalerweise nicht, oder? Nee, glaube ich nicht. Bike, Boing, Narp, Am Fahrrad gibt's das, was? <laughs> <laughs> ja, ja, das stimmt. Ist das vorn und hinten lehnen gar nicht. What? Versuch. Where's the word stimmt. poop from? Okay, there's a lot of enthusiasm for poob for whatever reason. Why poob? What am I missing here? I did not know what poob meant, but according to Google, poob is actually a one-time character from an episode of the obscure 1986 Star Wars cartoon show Ewoks, I guess. I we thirst awesome. for poob. <laughs> you think they have poob on YouTube? Orville's Hut of Horrors. <laughs> okay. Um, we can find poob. Oh, oh wait, here's the Hut of Horrors. Oh, God. <laughs> Incredible. Boom! Boom, ladies and gentlemen. Just, a, just incredible. Let's see that one more time. Boom! Boom, ladies and oh. gentlemen. I'm adding a command called Poob. Poob. Just oh, incredible. That's a cool such jump. Uh, and now Poob was ready. Poob? Poob? Ja, aber er scheint den Sprung jedes Mal einzeln zu Poop? ohne die Höhe. Poop? Da hast du eine neue Höhe ja, scheinbar. Da, wo er Poop sagt, ist dann quasi Poop? erst der Absprung. Poop? 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 Poob's feeling good. Poob's feeling good. Poob is already helping a Poob ton. Now we don't instantly <laughs> die off of cliffs, but it'd work even better if we have a command that jumps multiple times in a row. So let's add a new command that will string multiple <laughs> jumps together. Ooh. Poob hole is five jumps. Yeah, I guess we could try that. Add a command called poob hole. <laughs> poob hole. Poob hole. Ah. Oh, that is heavy. Poob hole. Yeah. Oh no, I poob hole too early. I'm out of poop. I have no more boobs. If we land this though, we win. Oh, er darf es nur einmal oder zweimal benutzen oder was? For you, poob. Do you say ploob? I did not I say ploob. Or are you talking about? Horville from Horville's Hut of Horrors from Ewoks, the 1985 TV show. A hideous and 
not cuddly poo. No, it's pretty clearly poob. There's no L there. <laughs> Quick side note here. At one point, somebody in the chat said that he's not actually saying poob. He's saying ploob. All jokes aside, it is clearly poob. Anyways. Ah, poob hole. Damn it! Poob? 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 Oh. No! Let's watch some more of that video. Maybe poob and ploob are different. He did not say ploob. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if it's it's good. You can hear it. It's first the, the the no That sounds yeah. like poop. That's poop. We're a little off track here. Let's let's go do this GTA <laughs> challenge. <laughs> yeah, what do you mean? Damn it. Poop hole. Poop. Poop. God. Confidence. Reggie. No! Oh god! <laughs> from listening closely, but the Wikipedia page <laughs> says poop. It's in the the Wikipedia article. Was a monster employed at Horville's Head of Horse? No, 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 no! This is fine. This is fine. Oh wait! It's yeah. poop. What the fuck? You guys, you guys, fucking, you did this. You can't go change the fucking. It's poop. He got this. Poop deserved better it's than this. Poop was having a perfectly good day before we came in here. He fucked his shit up, messing up Poop's legacy. <laughs> No! Poop. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's so clearly poop. Orville's Hut of Horrors. Okay, Paul Dini is the writer. Okay, he he wrote Orville's Hut of Horrors. Okay, even though he's clearly saying poop, this argument had literally been going on for hours, and we knew that the <laughs> only way to truly and definitively know whether this character is named Poob or Ploob was to ask the man who actually wrote that episode of Star Wars Ewoks <laughs> in 1986, <laughs> Paul <laughs> Dini, legendary television what writer. This is definitely the guy. He's legit. So we asked Paul Dini on Twitter to confirm it's actually poop. And now in the meantime, let's please get back to this challenge. This guy's going to be so confused. He's going to be like, wow, are people really arguing about this? Is this actually a big deal to people? Maybe I should check the comments of the YouTube video. And then he's going to come in here and everybody's just fucking <laughs> arguing about poop. Yeah, I'll be <laughs> Poop hole. <laughs> poop hole. God damn it, I said poop hole. The air coming from his pee, it's crazy sub <laughs> sibilance. It makes it sound like there's another letter there, but there isn't. It's definitely Ooh. poop. poop. <laughs> poop I think you guys are hearing him going, and then the mic quality is bad. It spikes up and sounds like an L, but he's clearly fucking so poop. <laughs> wow. <laughs> yeah, that's not. Osha. This is a super. Reggie? Be excited at the most. Reggie? Yeah. No! But then uh. the unthinkable happened. We checked Twitter. <laughs> Paul Dini, legendary television writer, had replied to our tweet. He didn't ask why we wanted to know. He didn't give any extra information. He just said one word. Plue. <laughs> After literally three <laughs> hours of nonstop arguing, the writer of Star Wars Ewoks <laughs> confirmed the horrible truth. It's ploob. In one tweet, Paul Dini had executed Order 66 and murdered the noble poob Jedi who had maintained this Wikipedia for uh, years. Wikipedia, the poob Wikipedia page was updated to ploob, and us loyal poobists were scattered to the wind, all because Darth Dini. <laughs> <laughs> Or had he? Sure, Paul Dini says it's Ploob, but nobody can deny that the community and Wikipedia page thought it was Ploob up until this point. And the English language isn't defined by one person, it's defined by how the community uses the language. If we look at Merriam-Webster's rules for how a word is That's added into the dictionary, they clearly state the <laughs> answer is uh, usage. <laughs> and they reject a word if its citations all come from a single source. Cough, cough, Paul. Dini. In fact, the entire study of descriptive linguistics defines language by how it's used without the bias of preconceived ideas of how it ought to be, Paul Dini. If the people used poob for the last 39 years and usage determines language, then shouldn't the people have the final say on which word is correct? Yes, they should.
So I did the only thing I could. I organized a full public trial on Twitch with over 500 witnesses and selected nine random jury members from the public who will evaluate the evidence presented and objectively determine once and for all, is it poob or plume? Poob court is now in session. The poob legal team will present their evidence. Evidence number one, lowered pitch of poob versus higher pitch of poob. What the f- Fuck. Temporal masking occurs when a sudden stimulus sound makes inaudible other oh, sounds which are descriptive present. linguistics. In blue is pre-blue revolution. Example of audio pareidolia. My proposal is that the original sound is poob, but with an L sound so the ing sound during Orville's blood curling was delayed to be what in the B and O, thus creating an L sound. Us Americans don't like how the British use their T, so we changed it to better suit us. Oh yeah, and we beat that voice command challenge. Osha? <laughs> <laughs> Osha? 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 Oh, 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 oh my god. 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 It took five hours and it fucking happened. Hello? Great job, nobody cares. Anyways, now the plume lawyer has a debate. Proper noun such as name cannot be changed by his name. The misspelling of plume name may be considered by a sobriquet. The litigious plaintiff who brought this case to court, Douglas Reed, Schlott, the director of the Ewoks, has declined to comment. Poob, which is a pube covered in poo. Both teams of lawyers have presented their arguments, and now it was all up to the nine jury members to decide. A simple majority vote from the public to end this once and for all. Five votes will determine the future of the English language. Our first juror, Sierra S11. One vote for Plume. Vic Gaming. 2-0 for Plume. Creeplosion. What is your verdict? It is Plume. Doom Mustard. What is your verdict? Plume. Well, we've been down before, but that's not gonna stop us. So now I ask you, a lonely boy, the final jury member, one more vote for Bloom and it's over. What is your verdict? <laughs> In a shocking, unanimous decision, all nine jury members voted Ploob. <laughs> so officially, in the 1986 episode of Star Wars Ewoks, the character's name is Plube. A hideous and not cuddly Plube. I may not like the decision, I may still believe it's Poob, but God damn it, I love democracy, and at least the people were the ones to make the decision, not just one man. And now my fellow Poob loyalists and I will take our leave and admit defeat. I, uh, At least until my White House petition to legally <laughs> change the name to Poop gets 100,000 signatures. You may have won this round, Paul Dini, but I'll be back in episode two, Return of the Poop. <laughs> okay. Okay, das ging in eine ganz andere Richtung, als ich halt Also, dachte. es ist immer noch Poop bei Wikipedia. Okay, kacke fürs Nachgucken. Ich meine, die, die People haben ja auch entschieden, ey. Aber gibt's auch Poop? Das war stark. Das war richtig, richtig gut. Vor allen Dingen habe ich Poop. damit null gerechnet. Ach ja, wir haben das geschafft, aber gut. Interessiert keine Sau. Das ist und bleibt Poop. Aber ich kenne das auch, weißt du, wenn der Twitch-Chat auf einmal irgendwas behauptet, wo ich denke, nein, das ist nicht so, dann muss man das ausdiskutieren. Aber der äh. hat jetzt das ein bisschen extremer gemacht als... Äh, ich das jemals gemacht habe. Ich war da schon stark <lacht> inklusiv in einem Court. Ja, auf jeden Fall. <lacht> Nein, <lacht> Internetseite. <lacht> Reicht nicht, dass der Writer das schreibt. Nein, der auch wirklich Nein. geschrieben hat. Nein, das muss dann erst noch ausdiskutiert werden. Fand ich super. Geniales Video. Also checkt den Originalkanal ab. Link in der Videobeschreibung. Vielen lieben Dank fürs Zuschauen hier beim React und morgen gibt's das nächste. Bis dahin, haut rein. Ciao. Tschüss.